Welcome back to The Local Show, a service of Geddes Federal Savings and Loan and Safe Harbor Wills and Trusts. The Local Show, featuring conversations with business owners, employees, and local business leaders about their successes, challenges, and reasons for doing business right here in central New York. The Local Show, locally produced by Zoe Advertising. Now, here are your hosts, Tom and Steve. And we're back. Happy spring. Doesn't get any better than this, unless, of course, you were down in Florida, <laughs> which is where I'm going to have to head in a while. Would you want to be in? Would you want to live in Florida in August? Uh, no, you know it's, it gets really hot down there. Everybody's got a pool. Everybody's got air conditioning. You could do it. You can do it. Now, you know, and I go down to Georgia all the time. And my dad was saying the other uh, a week that it was like 80 degrees over there. Yeah. So when that gets hot, it gets hot down in Georgia too. I don't know. You know, you get used to, it, it's just nicer to wake up in the morning and see that sunshine coming over the river. I wouldn't mind the change of seasons if winter wasn't one of them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if it was like we summer, spring, really fall, cold. summer, spring, I could do with that. It's yeah. that fourth season, that one that's <laughs> nine months long. Yeah, yeah, that, that kind of gets you. Well, it is the season to uh, do some home improvements. I know that uh, we did a home equity loan and, uh, you know, got to do some things around the house. Gettys can help a lot of people with that uh, and do it well. Absolutely. If if you're thinking, hmm, we got to fix this. We got yeah. to repair this. It's time to update. Um, there's equity in the house. I mean, real estate sure. prices went up. So guess what? The equity in the home went up. Right. So there's more There's more there. And we know with that Micron deal, things are going to float oh upward, my goodness. you know, even further. So, so. If, if it's time to, you know, uh, put a pool on or uh, do whatever, maybe fix up the house, um, getting money from Gaddis, it's local. You know, it, they're just, they're just, they're just great people. Or maybe it's mortgage time. Maybe it's get it yeah, pre-qualified. Right, right. People are still buying houses. The rates are still way lower than they were when we bought our first house. Sure thing. So uh, get it at Gettys right here in town. Gettys Federal Savings and Loan dot com. Tom? Neil Carr is back with us. He's the vice president of Prime Heating and Air. How are you, Neil? Doing well, guys. Good to see you again. Good to see you. PrimeHeatAndAir.com. PrimeHeatAndAir.com. If you want to follow along. Neil, walk us through your personal and professional background. How'd you get over to uh, this um, HVAC business? Uh, yes, yeah, so I got a, a business background. That's what I went to school for. Um, what college you go to? It was down in Pennsylvania. It was a uh, Thaddeus Stevens College of Technology down there. Okay. Got my associate's degree in business administration. We'll pretend that's real. Yeah. And okay. uh, he had me at Thaddeus. He, <laughs> yeah. he had me at Thaddeus. Yeah. Google, Google it. It's down there. <laughs> okay. We right, believe right it. Right, Thaddeus. In heart, right in the heart of Lancaster. <laughs> uh, funny, my brother actually went there too. That's where he got his HVAC really? uh, okay. uh, yeah. diploma in too. So. Lancaster. Yeah. yeah right the way you said it. Now it's like. Lancaster. It's yeah. not Lancaster. <laughs> yes, did you say that again? Yeah, Lancaster. Ah, uh, yeah. yeah. Come on now, now. We went to a theme park down there. What theme park is in Lancaster? Uh, it's called, uh, uh, shoot. Uh, is yeah, the, there is one. There is one. There I remember is, uh, we, we took the kids down there yeah, when they were young. Yeah, there is. <laughs> the, the Amish games. It may come to me. It, <laughs> yeah. may come it was a really cool one, yeah. actually. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it may come to me by yeah, the time okay. we're done. I don't know. All right. Uh, but yeah, so yeah, I uh, spent a lot of time different different companies through the years. Um, and then uh, after Dwayne had started Prime, mm -hmm. um, he about a year and a half in, he needed an, extra, help. an yeah. extra set of hands, an extra person to kind of take over the, the operational side of things. So that's what I do. So, Excellent. Yeah. Uh, fit my background well, um, personality-wise, too. Uh, well, so you know, that's good. so important. Um, King's Dominion. Yeah. Was King's Dominion? That, that is, does that ring a bell? Uh, yeah. yeah. Is, is that I Lancaster? Ish. I don't know. Ish, yeah. Okay. yeah. All right. Well, anyway. Yeah. yeah. You know, it's hard to uh, find people who are in the trades. Um, sometimes they're very good at what they do, but they yeah. don't have a lot of personality. And uh, that that getting back to people, um, the customer interfacing is difficult. Yeah, that part was hard. Just, there's only so many hours yeah. in the day. Imagine Tom answering yeah. the phone. Oh, yeah, I, we don't have any heat. What? What? Imagine, you know, yeah. it's cold. Imagine Tom so, being hey, the I'm customer. I'm cold, too. I, yeah. <laughs> I'm cold, too. Right. <laughs> so, but, yeah, no, nah, he, uh, he's good. He just, you know, there's only so many hours in a day. If you're if you're out, you know, you're working all day putting the equipment in and fixing everything. By the time you get back, it's, you know, evening time. And then right. you, know, you got to follow up. Then it's what nine ten o'clock at night by the time you get done. So 
Yeah, it was tough uh, doing it all, everything. So yeah, so yeah, you bring it was definitely you bring able a lot to come in and take table. a lot of that off his plate, so he could focus on the things he's great yeah, at. This is really important. Okay, I looked it up. Ahead. Did you guys go to Dutch Wonderland? Dutch Wonderland. Dutch Wonderland. Yeah, that's, that's, it. that's the yes, one. You're right, Steve. That's, yeah, that's the, the one. one. Theme park in Lancaster. Yeah, Dutch Wonderland. Dutch Wonderland. Right, right, on, right on Route 30. It, yep. it, yeah. it opens. Uh, it opens uh, midday every Nobody day. Nobody around here is caring what we're talking about right now. Off to. It is a great place to take your kids if you got you know people 10 years of age or under. That's down. it. Head down yeah, to Lancaster. Wonder. That's Wonderland. If you want to see the Amish, go to Walmart about three in the morning. <laughs> That's great. All right. So what's uh, what's good in the HVAC world right yeah. now? And how confusing is it to homeowners that you talk to? With this Kathy Hochul, let's say, I heard that dishwashers now, you can't even have a, a high capacity dishwasher. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's something new every time. Yeah. Uh, you know, it's one of those things where it's, you know, have it in the back of your mind, think about it, plan for it. Um, but I wouldn't panic just yet. Um, okay. But as far as furnaces go, um, you know, heat pumps, all that kind of thing. They're great. They're very efficient. They work wonder wonderfully. Uh, this time of year, especially if you're, you've got an old AC system um, and you're thinking about replacing it, you know, mm -hmm. look at an option of a whole house heat pump. Um, leave your furnace throw the heat pump in there. Yeah. And then, you know, you have a nice dual fuel system. Furnace can be the backup if you need it. Um, and then if we ever get down that road far enough where, you know, everything does end up going that way, you've got the heat pump there already. So do, do people do that or do they just wait for it to break? Uh, <laughs> you get both. Yep. Some people, some people are very proactive, um, you know, maybe four or five years yeah. ahead of schedule. They're like, Oh, it's, you know, it's getting up there and they want to replace it. And then there's those who, Oh, uh, just throw some more refrigerant in it. We could probably get another year out of it, you know, and it's 25 years old. So you get both. You get both. Are you guys uh, able to be pretty responsive at this point, meaning yeah. that you're not pushing people off six, yeah. seven, eight weeks? No, no, months. not that far, yeah. Um, right now, you know, we're probably two or three weeks out. Um, you know, we okay. get into the heart of the summer. You know, it might stretch to yeah. Unless it's an four, emergency, but, right? Right, yeah. Uh, and, you know, AC season, you know, Emergency Less. is it, you know, you figure it out if, you know, it's an elderly couple or, you know, right, somebody with some right. health issues. Yeah. They got to get their AC. In. So if it was Tom, if it's Tom, he's, he's sweating for a weekend. We'll see him on Monday. Yeah. Well, when we get those really hot, hot spells during the summer, yeah. can, can one of those heat pumps that does heat and air, will that efficiently oh, cool yeah. the house? You'll get no your problem. AC. No problem. Yep. Yeah. Absolutely. Because I had heard some rumors and I don't know whether, you know, people are trying to make heat pumps look bad. They were saying, well, the AC is just not as efficient. Oh, that's definitely not true. Yeah, it's okay. way more efficient than, it, what, you know, what you've got uh, in your house. Air. Yeah, okay. uh, it's still forced air. Oh, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. That is all the same. Um, it's, you know, but it's way more efficient than your traditional oh, okay. good. straight that's AC. Good to know. Yeah, for sure. Do you guys do, do duct work as well? Would yep. you come in and duct a whole house? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Okay. Yeah, remodels, new construction, we do that. Um, full duct work systems. Uh, we just did one out towards Weedsport uh, this, this winter. Nice. Um, we got one down in the city. We were just wrapping up now. Um, yeah, full duct work. We can do all of that. And yep. you do some commercial stuff. I know we never really talked yeah. about that. Yeah, we do a little yep, light commercial. We, you know, we'll swap out rooftops. We'll do commercial maintenance, all that stuff. Um, you know, we've done some new, new projects, um, some smaller ones, you know, a couple rooftops with some spiral duct work. We've done all that before, so we can do it. Um, it's just a matter of, uh, yeah, if it's a good fit for us. You yeah. know, the reviews are great. If folks want to check you out online. Yeah, we've, um, yeah, we've just gotten a few of them recently too. Um, some satisfied customers, which is great. And we really appreciate the feedback we get from our customers. You know, honestly, even sometimes if it's, you know, more on the negative side, we like to hear about it. Um, definitely call us, you know, right. if, if you got an issue, call us before you throw it out on Google. But if that's the way you go, <laughs> then we'll, we'll definitely follow up with you. Uh, we won't just leave a, leave you hanging. So, you know, sometimes, you know, it's unintentional every time it's unintentional, sure. but, uh, Sometimes things happen, but uh, we try to do everything we can. A lot of integrity over there. Yeah, Prime excellent. Family owned and operated. That's uh, Neil Carr and vice president of Prime Heating and Air, primeheatandair.com. Thank you, Neil, and have a great rest of the day. You too, guys. Thanks a lot. Good to see you. All right. Jeff Zarnowski is coming up next. He's an orchardist at Z's Nutty Ridge. Everything nuts. The show's nuts. Coming up on the local show on 570 WSYR.